The problem is that Estherford's house is kind of in the way. Well, it's not kind of in the way. It's really in the way. So, what I think we're going to do is we're going we're gonna to run this down here. And I'm going to just do this for now. Just so that people can get up and down quickly. We'll, we'll fill in all of this when we're a bit happier with our production cap capacity. We'll, uh, we will get the market going though. And I am going to assign like a couple more vendors I think. Where are the vendors? There's the vendors. Uh, so we've got three for each. Now yeah, that'll do for now. Okay. Um, yeah, what I think I'm going to do, I'm going to give, um, I'm going to keep a garden, right? And um, we'll we'll have the road actually going either side. So Old Street will come down here, and it'll split into two to go around uh, Estherford's old house, and then we'll kind of see what the hell we're going to do with moving the farms and stuff. So there you go. That's that. Uh, should we have a look at some of the graphs? Let's have a look at some of the graphs. So we want ten year. Oh look, everything is going up kind of nicely. Let's look at twenty five. Oh, ho, 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 ho. everything is going very nicely. Where's education? Where's education level? Uh, God, it's been a while since I've looked at this population. Uh, Oh, come on. Where's education level? I don't... I, you know what? I'll figure it out later. I'll figure it out later. Cool. Closed. Educated. 72% at the moment. So, yeah. We do need another school. So, another school's going to be a bit of a priority. Um, maybe we put a school in down here. I think that might be a nice idea. Yeah, you know, we're going to do it. We're going to do it. Like, what the hell? Let's get another school going. Um, so, school, book. There we go. So I'm thinking we put another school, like, down here. Yeah, on the corner. On the corner of um, Tradesman Row and uh, Lara Road. Yeah, that seems that seems to work for me. Alright, so let's pop that in there. Good. Okay, we've got a school going. How much stone is that? So that's only 16. That's not a big deal. Good, good, good. Um, am I going to double up this road? Uh, you know, I think I am. Yeah, let's, let's just double that road up so that we've, we've got it in. Alright, cool. Cool, cool, cool. You know what? Am I going to put in a little... Yeah, I think I'm, I'm going to put in a little bit of brick road here. Uh, now, where's the where's the center of that? Ah, okay. So that's that's the center. So we'll put a bit of that. So just so that I've kind of marked it off, let's just spin that round, make sure it's in the right place. Yeah. So that's that's bang in the center of those those doors. We'll I, it'll probably be three wide, but we'll see. We'll see. Oh, I do like that with the tower and everything. Very very cool building. And I, I, I don't know whether I'm going to keep trees or... I can always, like, do decorative trees and stuff. Alright, enough of that. Let's keep going. <laughs> oh, I get so absorbed. Get so absorbed. Right. The food seems to be holding steady at around the 15,000 mark, which is kind of good news. Um, stored firewood is kind of okay at the moment. Um, logs. We can, we can, we've got 21 labourers. We can start thinking of uh, increasing our foresters a bit. Let's increase our foresters a little bit. Uh, we're kind of, sort of, not so fantastic on stone, but we've increased our stone cutters to eight. I might increase that to ten because we need a good supply of that. Iron is a little bit low. Um, how are we doing for miners? We've got ten stone cutters, ten more. So that means we've got five on coal and five on iron. Which is not like massive amounts, but I think we'll survive kind of for now. Um, we're at 275 tools. Huh. Okay. 275 tools. This guy's working on iron tools. 
I switched this to iron tools as well. So I'd expect to see this number going up. I'm going to keep a little eye on that. Is it time to raise our limits on some of these things? Feels at 4,000. That's okay, Will. Um, or is it? Ah, potentially it's not, you know, because of the like the charcoal situation or whatever. Let's bump that up. Let's bump that up to 10,000. Uh, iron will take up to 1,000 now. Stone, same thing, we'll take it up to a thousand. I don't think we're going to use that. Logs is already out a thousand, which is cool. Coal separate from fuel, so that's okay, and I don't think that's going to be an issue. Uh, alcohol's limited to 500. We can bump that up to a thousand for sure, although I don't think, again, that we're going to hit that. Tools is limited to 500. I think we should look to boost that up to a thousand now as well. Alright, so we've upped our limits. Okay. This market's got built, which is absolutely peachy. Like that. So now we've got six vendors who are shipping stuff in. That will help things out a bit. Okay. Um, you know, I, I really, really wish this was one further back. I really do. I'm so, I must admit, I am really tempted to actually knock this building down and just move it back one. Ah. Okay. I'm going to use some more bricks because um, I, I really like the bricks, the brick roads. And what we're going to do, we're going to do, um, we're gonna do a bit, bit of brick road stuff around the market, I think. So, we're going to run a brick road around there and it's uh, it's not yellow brick in case you were wondering if there are any Elton John fans out there this is not the yellow brick road so we'll run that around there now you can also run them through the market itself so for example like from from there you can go through like all here uh, so let's do that bit and then come through here. And it just means that they'll be really fast moving through here. Let me pause this for a second because I don't want to miss this trader. I did see it! <laughs> In case you thought I hadn't. Um, so that comes through there. This comes through here. Uh, and you can even fill this stuff in. Like, it's a bit here and a bit here and a bit here. So we'll have we'll have all of this bricked out, which I think is quite nice. I think it's quite a nice effect. And that bit. Uh, I've already done that bit. Can't do that. Uh, done all that. Yeah, I think, I, I think, I think I've think i done all of it now that you can do. Uh, oh, now there's a bit... Is that a bit there? Cool, excellent. Right. What next? Uh, what next is to do the same thing on this market. Now, this is going to be a lot of bricks that we're we're using up but I think having them really fast around the market is probably a smart idea so we'll run that around the outside and then we'll do again the same same stuff I'm probably not going to be quite so fussy this time we'll do it uh, but let's let's do the the obvious ones oh, look see you got all these all this you can do Let's run that through there. Right, that'll do for now. Okay, let's go see this trader. See what this trader's brought. Although, to be honest, we've got most of the cool stuff now. Now it's just like more seeds and stuff like that. Uh, what's this guy? Oh, 400 stone. <laughs> oh, yeah, mama. We're going to have some of this stuff. Now, we can't use the venison and the bison meat, but we can use uh, this stuff. Now, ah, good point. Wool coats. Because what I want is to not use the hide coats, but to use wool coats. So, wool coats, wool coats. Do we have any wool coats? Let's crank this up to like. Um, what? Like. 200. Right? And let's send back the, uh, the hide coats. Where's the hide coats? H, H, H. Come on. Hold it together. Uh, fire was a little bit on the low side, so... 
Uh, let's just let this run a little bit and see what we get. See if we actually get any wool coats. I don't think we've got anything else that's massively tradable. I think we're starting to eat into the, the charcoal supplies already. Um, I mean, I'd love to pick up some of these bricks, but like, the stone is the most important thing. So we'll pick up the stone. And that alone is going to be like 2,800, so... Uh, we're not producing... It doesn't look like we've got any wool coats, which is kind of a bit of a surprise. Um, let's bang in 750 firewood. Uh, I've paid by 200, so let's bring that down uh, by 40, so 700. That was close-ish. Right, let's trade that, so that at least we've got the stone going on. The 200 logs wouldn't be a bad idea either. That's a nice buy. So, 400, so that's 100 firewood. Boom. Right, we'll trade that. There's 100 steel tools, which would be kind of nice. That number's coming up though, and I'm not really too worried about steel tools. I'd much rather have something like coal. Uh, I might, I might just nick. And then how much coal we got? We've got 200 coal. Let's um, let's take 100 coal. Bricks, I'm not going to take. Uh, so we need 600 units, which would be 150. Bingo. Trade that. And. Is there anything that I want him to bring me, like, every time? Yeah, stone. <laughs> bring me stone every single time. And I'll remember to say every visit. Okay, we're done. Thank you for coming. You've been awesome. Oh, we've got some wool coats coming in. Oh, that's good. That's very good. Oh, do I buy some more of something? No, to be honest, I don't think there's anything that I really, really, really want. I've already got the logs and stuff. Yeah, that'll do for now. Cool. Thank you. Excellent. Look at all the lovely stone. Oh, man. Now we can get cracking. All right. Oh, we can go a bit crazy now, guys. Putting in houses and stuff. But I, I, I do want to do these kind of, like, fairly... Intimately, I want to. I do want to like build these, um, so that they're their own little houses. Like each one would be a little bit individual. Uh, you know what? Let's let's just get on with it. So, I th I think we should have maybe a row of country houses along here. I think that would be kind of nice. But I'm going to leave a gap of like maybe two. One, two. Is that enough of a gap? Maybe three. Yeah. I don't know. This is like right in the town. The demand is going to be very high. I, you know what? No. I'm going to put... Um, I'm going to put these in actually quite close together. So I'm only going to leave a gap of one. Like just enough to have a hedge in between. And they'll have gardens out the back and stuff. So we've got, um, we've got two country houses going in. That's very good. Let's check on the boarding house. How are we doing? So there's nobody living in the boarding house, so we're good on houses. Uh, I would like to start upgrading these. So, shall I? Shall I? Yeah. Where's that one? That one's there. These are kind of not necessarily in the right place, though. You know, we might... Yeah, we might have a bit of a demolition going on here. <laughs> Let's get this... Let's start to get this going. Let's get rid of this one. Cool. You'll get. Don't complain. You're getting a new house. Don't don't get fussy. Right. What? Um, do we get the glassworks going? Uh, you know, probably that's not a bad idea. But if we're going to do that, then we need um, a shoreman producing some um, some sand. Maybe we put a shoreman in over here. Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's put in a shoreman. How's the food? The food's dipping a tiny bit. 
going to need to crank up the rest of these fishermen, I think. Okay, let's quickly put in a shoreman then. So, where's the... Uh, that's the glass work. Shoreman, the one with the shovel. That's it. Let's put a shoreman in. Um, so, I'm going to spin you around that way. Let's put a shoreman in here. Boom. And he's going to want a house. So, let's give him a house. And that's going to be um, a nice stone house. Which is quite posh for a shoreman, really. Because all he's doing is digging stuff up all day. Um... Now, where are we going to put your house? Then we're going to put your house there, you know. There. I was thinking about putting it here, but I'm not. I'm going to put it there. Right. The other fishermen. We need to we need to optimise these guys and get them uh, producing good levels. So let's put in a storage barn for this guy. Uh, so it's going to be storage barn. Um, hmm. I was thinking there, but. Uh, maybe we want to leave room for a house on the other side. Uh, maybe we put the house in first. Uh, no, I'm going to put the I'm going to put the two houses on this side. No, screw it. What, what the hell? So I'm going to put that in there, and then we'll get a couple of houses, and again stone houses. Spin that puppy around, and there and. Yep, there and there. Cool. Right, now this guy is the only one left. So, it did the same deal. A storage barn for him. Oh, see, I had this issue about this though, didn't I? Yeah, do I address this first? Oh, I don't know. don't know. So I could put that in there. So at least he's, I'll put that in, so at least he's got a storage barn going on. Make him a little bit more efficient, but he does need the house. I, well, I guess I could put a couple of houses up here, like even if they're temporary. Um, so, right there, and there, there we go. Oh, another little save game going on, thank you. Right, we are a bit low on our iron. I think we need to find some more iron and send our masses of labourers to go and get it. Where can we find some iron? There's, um, there's iron and stone and stuff over in this area. It's early autumn. Uh, it's probably not the best time to send them out, but I'm going to do it anyway. Uh, let's pause this for a sec. I need to go and check in on the families and stuff. I haven't done that for a while. Right, so... Um, a few bits of iron there you can grab. And... This is this is a bit of a long walk. Grab these. And... All of that. And then when you've done that... Do I grab some stone? No, I... Uh, stone's not an issue. But trees kind of is. So you know what? Grab a bunch of these trees. And grab a bunch of these trees. And we'll grab a bunch from over here as well. Boom, 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 boom. And I'm going to... Am I going to prioritise? I think I'm going to prioritise... Yeah. yeah, I'm going to prioritise probably the first group of trees or something. So let's prioritise... The first group of trees and the first bit of iron. There you go. So we'll get a bit of both coming in. Alrighty. Right, we've got like lots of labourers. So we can crank our foresters up, I think, to max. Because we kind of need to. Still so got 23 labourers, 8 builders who are unemployed. Because there's nothing to build. Well, naturally, well, there is some stuff to build now. But, but they won't have got the stuff for it. So another trader. Here we go. Oh, ho, ho. 3,000 stone. Oh, my Lord. 3,000 stone. My God. Okay, well, right. <laughs> we need some stuff to trade for that. Um, what on earth can we pull in? 